playoff, Nace Rocket League playoff action. Uh, we had the players enter the match, but then the opposing team left, so not quite sure what's happening there. But so yeah, so round two of Nace playoffs, Aquinas will be against Misery Cordia University Cougars today, and in the regular season they finished five and five. I think they were I'm trying to remember seating wise. Uh, uh, to be honest, sorry, to be honest, can't remember the seed, but. Uh, they in the regular season they did finish five and five, so definitely. Oh, and George, let me know they were they were seventh, and Aquinas is second right now. So definitely still got the higher seed on them. So definitely a matchup that Aquinas can take. They just need to stay on the offensive pressure, like Benzing and I always say. Speaking of Benzing, by the way, he unfortunately isn't able to make it tonight, so it'll just be me out here. So we're just waiting to see the players get back into the game. All right, we see the players entering the match again. Aquinas will stick with Orange as they typically do. Here in a new stadium though, I don't think I've seen Aquinas play at Beckwith Park yet. So see a little bit of change of pace there. So start the match, Misericordia gets it off into their offensive zone, but Cade's there, he clears it out. Lowey tries to meet him. Gold zone going up. Gilly boy back in the corner, stocks now. Gonna try to get a tap off the back hole, can't find it. Lowey's gonna kick it out now. Gold zones there to meet him. Back into the corner. Knockers up the wall. Stocks now. Going to hit it off the back wall. Good angle for Cade coming in. Couldn't get a sh good shot off. He's out into the corner. Stocks goes after. He's going to float it above the goal. Gold zone. Going. Coming in for the shot. Can't find it. Knockers back into the corner. But Cade's there to 50 him. He's floating up now. Stocks going to go after it. Back off the corner. Gold zone going up for the shot. Can't find it. It's just wide. Cade. Allowing now, gonna have it. Stocks with a good challenge, sends it to the other side. Rolls up the wall, Gilly Boy is gonna tap it out. Gold Zone flying up, good shot, just a bit wide. Hayden now is gonna tap it out for Stocks, but Ockers is there. Cade with a good demo on the goalie. Gold Zone's gonna get off the back wall. Stocks coming in for the shot and it stopped. Gilly Boy is gonna get it, he's gonna clear it down. Gold Zone's gonna hit it off the wall. Up and above. Stocks coming over the shot, but Ockers is there with the save. Couldn't find the clear there. Gold Zone's gonna keep it in, but it gets demoed right after. Ockers is there, sends it up. He's there though. Meets it, sends it out front, but Flowey just gonna tap her off the side. Stocks kicks it out for Gold Zone. Can't really find it though, and Flowey's just gonna kick it back out. Cade now gonna carry it downfield himself. Gilly Boy with a soft tap. Stocks gonna get the touch. Gold Zone's gonna meet him. He's gonna win the 50. It's gonna go to the opposite corner. Ockers can't find it. He's able to get a touch though. Over to Gilly Boy. Now Stocks gonna tap it up. Ockers coming in, plays just above it. Lowey now. Gold Zone gets a soft touch. Cade gets demoed by Gilly Boy there. Rolling softly back into the corner. Stocks just gonna get it away. Ocker's coming in. Shot Gold Zone's there to stop it. Can't find the rebound though. Cade gets demoed again. It's gonna go up. Gilly Boy's gonna find it. Cade though with a shot. 
It's too soft off the ground though, and Knockers is gonna have an easy save. Aquinas is getting the shots they need this game, but they're just not really powerful enough to get in the back of the net. Chance now though, Cade up to himself, floats it back up. Stock's coming in just a little late there, but a good pass off the ceiling. Gilly Boy with a soft tap, Cade just flying under it. Stock's gonna float it up. Gold Zone's gonna clear it back out. Flowey's gonna tap it there for Gold Zone. Gold Zone's off the post, but Cade comes in for the shot. Gilly Boy is there to save it. Back off the back wall now. Flowey's gonna clear it out. Gold Zone's there, he's gonna hit it off the corner. Can't find the touch himself in stocks. I think he expected Gold Zone to get a touch on that. Sends back into the corner. Cade clearing it out now. A little bit of a mind game from Cade, allowing Stocks to go get it. Ocker is going to hit into the corner. Golden with a good tap to keep it in. Another good tap to get it out, but Flowey again is there. Cougars playing great defense this game. They've had multiple stops. They haven't really let Aquinas get many good uh, high percentage shots. Stocks now with a good shot. That's in! In Stocks. One minute left in the match. Finally gets somebody on the board and Aquinas goes up 1-0. Just off the post. Cougars couldn't really get a jump on it to get it out. In four minutes in, we finally have a goal. Aquinas up 1-0. Kickoff's gonna go over to Stocks. He's gonna float it up. Gilly Boy going up for it. Good tap out of there. Gold Zone going after it. Good flip into it off the back wall to himself. Out in front of the goal, Gilly Boy. Good awareness there to kick it out. Now Stocks. Soft over to Flowey. So Flowey can't really get it out either. Stocks just gonna float it up. Goldum going after it. Cade trying to flip into it. Gilly Boy shot downfield. Goldzone's there, he's gonna clear it back out of there. Okay, nobody's really in goal yet, but Gilly Boy, great job of getting back. Ockers puts it right in front of the net though, but Flowey comes in. 15 seconds left to Aquinas, trying to find their security goal, trying to keep it out of their zone. Ockers is gonna send it back. Gilly Boy, stop by gold zone. Flowey, sends it a little bit wide, maybe like a pass, but with a second left. Cade, hopefully gonna let it touch the ground, it's still floating though. And it hits the ground and Aquinas takes game one, 1-0. One -oh. Great resilience by Aquinas there. Misericordia, yeah, six saves to Aquinas's nine shots. So a lot of shots put up, but as I said, not a lot of them were very powerful. They were soft taps that Misericordia could easily catch up to. But Aquinas did a great job sticking with it. Stocks finally found the goal off the assist from Cade. And they take game one of a best of five, 1-0. We'll see if Aquinas can keep off that offensive pressure heading into game two. Game two now, Aquinas up 1-0, off the kickoff. Shot up towards the ceiling, hits off. Flowey coming in now. Teammate tapped it though. Stocks gonna clear it downfield. Ockers can't really find a touch. Stock's gonna send it off the wall, but Flowey's gonna be there to kick it out. Ockers gonna hit into the corner. Goldzone's just gonna tap it out. Wins the 50. Gonna go after himself, flips it up. For Cade now. Gilly Boy's gonna send it down for Ockers. Ockers with a good redirect. It's gonna be off. And Gilly Boy just a little bit too, just a little bit off on that. Cade got demoed there. Gold Zone's gonna send it for him. Soft clear downfield, Gilly Boy. Back into the corner. Stock's going after it. Good tap off the wall for Gold Zone. Gold Zone just flies a little bit over that. Now Cade. Good job of keeping it away from the Cougars there. Gilly Boy's gonna go after it. Tap into the corner. Aquinas doesn't really have anybody back, but Cade flies in. He's able to clear it out. Ockers though gonna keep it back in. Stocks with a good clear, he's gonna go for himself, but Gilly Boy's gonna be there. So we're for Cade now. It's out in front, gold zone. It's up, Gilly Boy. Good flip, keeping it away from Stocks. 
Cade now out in front. Gold Zone's gonna hit into the corner. Healy Boy is there. Cougars are playing great defense this match. They have not shifted at all from game one to game two. Still just shutting down everything from Aquinas in an unfortunate time. Cade! Sticks it off the post for the save. I thought that was gonna go in. It took an unfortunate bounce off the right post. And the ball was about half in, but Cade flies in, taps it off the other post to pinch it out of there. We stay scoreless here in game two. Flowey now, a little bit of a redirect, but Cade's gonna be there, he's gonna boom it downfield. Flowey gets a demo on gold zone there. Zox is gonna get it. He gets demoed, but is able to kick it out front. The Gilly Boy's there. Cade, good job keeping it in. Out front for gold zone. Ockers is gonna be there though. Cade got the shot, I guess gold zone didn't get a touch on that. Floating up now, Flowey can't find it. Stocks just gonna float it up for Cade. Cade flying just past it. He can't find it. Gilly Boy looking for a demo there. Couldn't find it though. Now Stocks gonna clear it off back wall. Can't find it himself. Out for Gold Zone. Gold Zone's gonna boom it downfield. There's a lot of back and forth this game. Aquinas getting a couple shots they need, but nothing finding the back of the net again. Stocks runs out of boost, but still able to find it. It's gonna go off the back wall. Cade coming in. Ockers floats it up there. Gold zone now. Good tap once, but then he unfortunately taps it again, but it doesn't matter because Stocks with a shot. Nobody was back. I'm not sure what happened there for the Cougars, but Stocks just sends it out towards the goal. I guess, yeah, Flowey was in a bad position to be goalie there. And I believe that was Gilly Boy coming in. Tried to be the goalie, but didn't have enough time, not enough boost, can't get up there. Stocks again, puts Aquinas up. Now Cade trying to fly in, but it's off the backboard anyway. And then Ockers comes in, and Ockers scores a goal just seconds after Aquinas does. Tie the game one to one. There's a great flip into it, and Cade unfortunately just little out of position there after flying in to try to get the first shot. One to one now. Gold Zone's gonna send it off the side wall. Going after himself. Hawker's gonna be there though. He floats it out towards the other side. Cade now, boom downfield. Hawker's gets a demo on stops. Soft tap by Gilly Boy there. Gold Zone wins at 50. Stock's now gonna keep it himself. Little bit, ooh. Tried the flick there, couldn't. Couldn't get it. Just tapped a little bit. Ocker is going to send it back into his own corner. Cade going back to get boost. Stocks now is going to go after it. Good 50 though. Gold Zone's going to hit it back into the corner. One minute left. Tied one to one in game two. Gilly Boy can't find the tap. Flyby's going to send it towards the goal. Gold Zone flying in. Taps it off the backboard for the save. Ocker's coming in with the rebound. Cade's going to send it up. Gold Zone now is going to get it out of there. Gilly Boy flying up. He's going to send it back. Cade gonna send it out towards the side wall. Now Flowey, Gold Zone's gonna be there though. Flowey can't get the tap, now Gold Zone's gonna send it. Another tap over to Cade. But Cougars were there again. Gold Zone, ooh, is just unfortunately a little bit in the way there. Can't do anything about it. Good 50 though from Gold Zone, he's gonna find the net. Good challenge by Gold Zone. He wins it and he gets possession. He doesn't just lose it. Like, just great job by him. Sometimes on those, it'll just fly away from you and there's nothing you can do about it. But he does a great job of keeping it with him. And because of that, he's able to put it in the net and send Aquinas up two to one with 17 seconds left on the kickoff. Goldson's gonna send it back for Cade. Cade's now is off the back wall. Oh, but he gets it himself. Let's see this. Goldzone floats it up. Cade off the back wall and he sticks with it. Gets his own rebound off that back wall. Puts it in. Aquinas has their security goal with 11 seconds left. They may have just put this away right there. Floating up now, Cade off the kickoff. Flowey's gonna be there though. But with six seconds, it's not gonna happen. Aquinas is gonna take game two. See if there's a consolation here. There isn't, he lets it touch the ground and Aquinas takes game two. Three to one.
Aquinas there five shots that time. Three of them found the net though. Misericordia with six. That game just seemed like a, it was a lot of back and forth, back and forth. Each team just kind of feeling each other out. Can't really get, didn't really get any powerful shots. There's a little bit of aerial play, but it's nothing, I don't want to say fantastic, but it's nothing like RLCS, like nothing too fancy. Just basics, just booming it back and forth. But still, even though Aquinas usually likes to play that little fancy, fancy game, they've still found a way to chip it out win both games, heading into game three now, looking for the sweep. And, oh, it looks like they still haven't gotten their third player in. Not sure if he left the lobby, so we'll likely, oh, you can see Ocker's there glitching, so, oh, he can't join, so we'll leave the match, hop into another one. While we're kind of on break here real quick, I'll kind of explain the playoff situation. So, because we weren't able to stream the last match because it was forfeited. So, this is round two of ooh, either four or five, I believe. So, it's single elimination. So, once Aquinas loses, if they lose, they'll be done. So, that's why it's extremely important to not just throw away games here. And this, I believe this playoff situation will narrow it down because it's in groups. Yep, we're back in game three now. It'll narrow it down to groups and once we're out of like the group playoff stage, it'll be the top four for potentially the NACE Rocket League Fall Championship. So we're back in game three now. Ockers with a good touch. It's just going to go wide. K now is going to pinch it off the back wall. Good pinch there. Flowey though, he's going to find it. Docks with a good 50. Ocker's going up to meet it. Soft tap though, and Cade, he's gonna find it. Goes up, not a lot of boost. Ooh, but Gilly Boy is there. Just floats it up. Oh, Antor just messaged me and said that top two go to Atlanta for the championship. And Aquinas, while I, was <laughs> while I was busy talking, Stocks finds the goal early on past two games we've only seen goals three four minutes in but stocks just 40 seconds into it finds one now he's gonna find it off the back wall the gilly boy's there to meet it gold don't grant gold don't can't find it okay a little bit of a flip flowey can't get in, in time gold don't clears it away and Kate gets it out Kate with a good demo on ockers there stocks gonna boom it down towards the net ockers gonna fly in though coming off that spawn Makes the stop. Gold zone now. Can't really find it. Stock's just going to float it up for himself. Gold zone racing in. Going to tap it off the corner. For Cade with the shot and it's in. Cade off the good pass from gold zone. Puts Aquinas up 2 0. They get their security goal early. Just to the left of that right post. Great placement. Nobody back for Misericord. Nobody in net for Misericord, I should say. Aquinas goes up 2-0. Cade okay, now off the kickoff. Gilly Boy with a good jump. Kate can't really get it up the wall. Doesn't matter because Stocks is going to be there anyway. Gilly Boy's going to hit it in the corner. Golden with a good pinch to get it out front. Flowey gets a tap on it. Double demo right there. Gold's only the only one in the offensive zone. Cade with a good shot on that angle. Gold Zone just floats it up. Slams it back down when he falls, and Cade, with a good, powerful shot off that tight angle, finds it. Puts Aquinas up 3-0, and it looks like they've finally found their offensive footing here in game three. Flowey now with a shot, it's just high. Gold Zone, good job of backing up. If he would have touched that, that would have been in. Gilly Boy now with a shot. A little bit of a double commit, but at that point, can't really do much. 
Somebody's got to make that stop, but he just places it just above. Minus up 3-1. Now Gold Zone gonna clear it out. Gilly Boy sends it all the way back. Ockers now. Cade wins the 50. He's gonna clear it out. Gilly Boy going up for it. Can't find it! That's in! Cade finds it off the wall with the long goal. Sends it out past midfield. Gilly Boy can't get up and reach it, and it's in. And after giving up the one goal, Aquinas finds another of their own to go back up by three. Stocks with good floats, keep it away from Ocker. He's gonna go for it himself. He's gonna tap it down, but Gilly Boy is gonna be there. He's gonna go over to Cade, though. He's gonna hit it into the corner. Yeah, up front, Flowey hits it out in the middle, but both Aquinas players off to the side a little bit. Not a good angle. Cade's going to send it out for stocks. Hit it off the corner. Flowey and Cade going up for a Flowey wins over to gold zone. Hit it out towards the middle, but nobody's there. And Gilly Boy is just going to tap it. A little bit of a miscommunication there, possibly. Cade bit out of touch on that, but he didn't. Stocks still able to get it away. It's out in the corner now, Stocks. Gonna get a good pass up for Gold Zone. Gold Zone. It's a little too high for that. Tough to get a shot on that, too, when it's above the crossbar. Stocks, good 50 there. Keeping it in. Flavi's gonna pinch it back towards his net. Octo's gonna get back. Kate sends it to Gilly Boy. Gonna find it himself out towards midfield. A double demo there. Stocks on Ockers, and Ockers gets him right back. Ockers now. Gold zone, good challenge. Keeps it. Down to the corner. Gold zone racing in. Gonna hit it off the corner. Flowey keeps it in. Cade now. He's gonna clear it out. Gilbo can't really find the touch. Cade gonna get a tap over to Gold zone. Gold zone floats it up. Flowey coming in. He stops it. With the shot again, off the backboard. Stocks coming in. Can't really get a good shot on that. Cade, back into the corner. Cade with a 50, can't really get it though. Flowey spinning around, can't find it. Gold zone's gonna clear it back out with 40 seconds left. Looks like Aquinas might take this match too. A little bump from Stocks on Cade there. Doesn't affect much of the play though, but it's back in the corner. Flowey going after it, but Gold Zone's able to touch it. 30 seconds left. And if Misery Cordy doesn't score now, this match is likely going to be over, and Aquinas will take it. 20 seconds. Cade clearing it out over to Stocks. Gold Zone with a good clear there, and with 10 seconds, it's all but over. And Cade with a shot just a little wide. Doesn't matter, though. With six seconds, <coughs> excuse me. Four seconds, three, and that'll be the match. Aquinas will take game three and the match. Wait to see what happens. It'll hit the ground there. Aquinas takes game three, four to one, and takes the match three to zero, oh, and will advance to round three of the NACE playoffs. They'll be back out here Monday again, most likely, but for the NACE playoffs, but they'll be here Saturday again, too, for some more Gleck action. And Angel wanted me to let you guys know. So the stream will be ending now, but please come out again at 9 p.m. because we will have, because Aquinas League of Legends will be playing Michigan State here on the Aquinas Esports Twitch page. So I'll see you guys Saturday.